up there with Caesar. <laughs> he played too much. He could not wait. <laughs> He could not wait yeah. to play with this helium. I'm playing with the helium, hold up. Well, I can't drive with the balloon. I can't drive with the balloon in the back, so hold up. Go ahead, babe, tell him where we going. Tell him where we going. <laughs> Let me do something. Where's that? Right here. We going to take the baby to the first pediatrician, pediatrician <laughs> appointment. <laughs> ah, you sound funny, girl. <laughs> you so funny. Here you go. Get some more. Where is it? Yeah, this is Marae first appointment. We can't wait. They're gonna weigh the baby again and we're gonna see how much Marae's weighing. I'm so excited for this appointment. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> mm. My mom is in the back. Mama in the back. Mommy say hey, what's up to Goodwin season? What's up? Is your seatbelt on? No. Yeah, put your seatbelt on. Girl. girl. Click it or ticket. Hold up. I'm a backseat rider. Click every ticket. Put your seat better on, Mom. <laughs> Buckle up. I'm a backseat rider. Hey, it's got my boy Santa. Whee! Baby Murray back there. We got the mirror. It looked like baby. Baby, Ray, smile for the camera. Oh, wait. I can't zoom in on the front. But it looked like baby ain't take the plastic off the mirror. Oh, I didn't. Ah. <laughs> I just see her face, though. Yeah. You can see it real good? Yeah, I can see it. Y'all, I got my pumps on. They silent. LV. They silent, so you can't hear it. Hey, you wanna, you portable wanna, pump. You want to cap this off? All right, y'all, so we going to hit y'all when we get back to the, uh, okay, now when we get try. to the pediatrician office. It's Let's see y'all when we get to the appointment. Y'all stay tuned. Make sure y'all hit that like button and that subscribe button up there, right there. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> <laughs> love, 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 love. Love chases fear away. Chases fear away. Yeah, it got to be love. Started to rain harder. Oh, you can get out of that rain. Mm. Get up for your appointment, Mama. Come on. Get up for your appointment. Follow Mama. Okay. Where you going? Mm -hmm. Baby bag is open. Go ahead in the newborn room. You talking to Union? Uh, <laughs> oh, country? Yeah. Watch, check in. No, I'm not country. Oh, yeah, I am. Yeah, this the newborn room. Oh. Because vaccines and stuff. Oh. So. All right, y'all. So we in the newborn room, but this guy is talking up there, so I'm going to check yeah. us in. Um, right now. All right. She's a couple days away from being a week old, so the pediatrician wanted to get some vitals and check her weight and just make sure everything is going good with her. So we in the waiting room right now, and you can hear. I think she is using the bathroom. Hold up. Just so cute, Ray Ray. Why are you so cute, baby? You're the most beautiful little girl in the world. She's saying, I know, I know.
first time Mama Bloom forgot the discharge papers. <laughs> so I, some forgot their discharge papers. What is what are discharge papers when the they let you out the hospital? The packet that they gave me for the baby, just the report from mm. for the baby. It's all good. What is today? Today. Tell mommy it's okay. Oh, oh look at my baby. Oh, look at look at mommy Mo. Filling papers out like a mom. <laughs> I think she boo boo. I think she boo boo. Yeah. Oh, did she? Oh, yeah, yeah. See, I forgot all that. Yeah. Ooh. That's spicy. Girl, what you eat? Mm -hmm. Breast milk. Dang, what type of breast milk do you feed her? That good, good. That good, good. Ooh. Mm -hmm. What you doing? Mm. I look colostrum. Tell them what colostrum is, babe. That's the healthy, fatty milk after birth. So, making her a bottle. So, uh, the colostrum, the colossal. Colossal colostrum. Well, this is Ooh. two separate pump settings. Oops, there's still some more in there. Every drop counts. Every drop. This is liquid gold. Yes, it is. I spilled it on the bed this morning. Show them where you're getting that. Oh, what? Pump. No, that was yesterday. Yeah, you definitely did. You got yeah. a little clumsy. These my my LV pumps. Yeah. Here we go. All right. My milk, milk haven't came in. I'm still, I still got colostrum. That's why it's so yellow. Mm hmm. Good, liquid. Look like eggs. You're doing some. It's sweet. Oh, I already tasted it. Yeah, it's sweet, isn't it? <laughs> I be sucking on them little thing things. <laughs> trying to get me some. Oh, Don't what? listen Look. to him. Yeah, just oh, clumsy. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this would have been the second time I would have spilled oh this my liquid. God, I'd have been so mad. No, I spilled it on the bed, really y'all. The our sheets are white. So, we got. Sixty. It's a real good bottle for her. Mm -hmm. Let me put this up. You see that? You see that, Marae? You got a lot of colossal. Maybe. Huh? Colostrum. You say what? Colostrum. What I say? Colossal, like a colossal shrimp. It's the same thing. No, it's not. Colostrum and colossal. That's what I said. I said, I said, colostal. Colostal. Colostrum. Oh, strum, like drum. Colostrum. Going to our room. Eight. Oh, wait, look. Hey. Where is mama? You can put uh, her down up there. Mm -hmm. Marie. My baby's sleeping. I don't know where my mama went, but somehow she got lost in the mix of the shuffles. <laughs> Here they come. Mama, you got lost? Mm -mm. I didn't know I can come back here. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is how it's going to be. Take my baby out of this car seat. I don't like cutting yet. <laughs> Y'all, her outfit's so big. Mm -hmm. This her little outerwear. So cute. She got a little sheep on. Now I'll be holding the lamb. 
the precious Lamb of God. Born into sin. That baby over there crying because the baby here. You. Getting a shot? No, the hear baby here you Please. singing. Crying because the singing is that good. Mm. Oh, she was just mm. Mama gonna change you. She do a way better job than Dada. But Dada's still good. Best believe it. Mm. Oh, looking in my purse. Man, baby got a nice bag. Go change. Water. Y'all, I got a girdle on. Hey. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna let mama change you and then we'll be, we'll be back, okay? Okay. So I told Mo, I see why we gotta have so many damn diapers, baby wipes, clothes. We didn't change her 50 times in three days. You said what? She kicked her boo boo. I mean, her hand. Her... She get wild hands when you get to change her. She be. Whoa. Whoa. She's like, dang, girl. She gotta be still. Get changed. But we change it so much, like, damn. <laughs> it don't all be that much. Well, after every feeding, I check and change her because she most of the time be wet after. Imagine if we had to have that many boxes or panties that you had she, to change. She finally got CD, all the way CD boo boo now. Who? CD boo boo, like uh, breast feeding boo boo. It look like little seeds. Use, use layman terms. We don't know these baby terms. Seedy boo boo. Seedy? Yeah. Me like and her. seedy? Seeds. Like little oh, seeds. Oh, seedy. Seedy. <laughs> Shit. All right. Hello, hello. How are y'all doing today? Good. How you doing? Good. My name is Akila. I'm your nurse today. Akilah. Did I pronounce her name right? It's Marae? Yes. Okay. Just want to make sure. Um, is your primary doctor going to be Dr. Siegel? Yes. I will be your primary nurse then. Okay? Awesome. Hey. We'll do the same nurse, same doctor around here. So y'all awesome. one big family. Let go. Mm -hmm. Now, of course, Miss Moran is not. Oh, mom, don't get a bad dress. She got to get back in the noise. I was about to say, <laughs> is she about to help you get this? We have to change that diaper. Now, yeah. no allergies to the medicines for her. She's not taking mm -hmm. any medicines. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Breastfeeding or formula, mama? Breastfeeding. How many minutes is she nursing for? Uh, about 30 okay. to 40 minutes. Every two to three hours? How many poops a day? Um, two. Okay. Lots of wet diapers. Lots of wet mm -hmm. every, after every Good. feeding. Is she sleeping in the bassinet, crib, pack and play? Shoe, bassinet, and in... Where would she get caught? Well, I already yeah. know how I go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did you have a bathroom delivery or C-section? Uh, How many weeks were you? Uh, 37 mm -hmm. weeks, one day. Okay. Did she get her hepatitis B vaccine? Yes. She passed her hearing test? Yes. And did John just say that? No. Okay. Any complications during your pregnancy? No. Any complications for her when she came out? Um, She just had a little bit of breathing, but they said that's normal for C-section. Okay. She didn't have to go to the NICU. Or no. Okay, good. What was her birth weight? Five pounds, 13 uh, ounces. And what day did y'all go home from the hospital? Saturday. Uh, that's what day? Yesterday. Oh, it's fine. Yesterday. Saturday, fine. Okay. Did they tell you how much she weighed before you left? Uh, she was up to what? Five, five pounds. Point, five, five pounds. Was it eight? Or? Yeah, eight ounces. Five she pounds, had eight dropped. Ounces. She dropped. She which is normal. Weight. They always yeah. drop first. Okay, so when you come back for your weight recheck, which will probably be later this week, mm -hmm. bring your discharge paperwork with you. Okay. Um, How'd y'all hear about us? Um, Dr. Jose Garcia. Oh, Lord. Dr. Garcia was our doctor. I've yeah. been taking care of his baby since they was born. Yeah. Yep. That's, yeah, why he, he that's why he recommended. Yeah, we good people. He is. He real good people. All right, Miss Murray. Let's right. see. I know. Why are you fussing? 
<laughs> All right, mama, so every time you come in, I'm going to tell you to strip her down. Okay. So you will strip her down. If you're in the big room, you go in there and get a blue truck pad like this. If you're in the other room, they're in the second floor. So you can look in all of them until you find it. So and strip her down like this. So put this in between the legs and find it in back. Okay? We're going to take the scale to get away. Come on, Dan. Let's I go, you, baby. Boy. Oh, yeah. This is my on, baby. So you, can, so you can see what's going on with hey, your baby. Hey, I got to see what's going on with my That's baby. Right. All right, Miss Mariah. Let's see how, how much, much you weigh. How much you weigh today, baby? Okay, you gain the ounce. you up an ounce. We'll take that, girl. Getting thick. We'll take that. All right, very good. She's looking good, Mama. No formula, just breast milk. She was unformula at first. Okay. Because my breast milk kind of came in, so everything is in on now. Yes. Okay, that's totally fine. Lost room had to just keep in maybe about what was that Saturday? Okay. okay. I mean Where not Saturday. Um, yesterday. Wasn't yesterday. It? Yesterday. And now mm -hmm. your milk coming in and everything. Mm -hmm. Good. All right. So put a diaper on, just a diaper and a blanket, okay. and Doctor Susan will come in and do her exam. So she got a hepatitis B already. She's not due for any shots today. Okay. Also, she stays home with both parents. Yes. Any grandparents? No. Okay. No. Just both parents. Any pets at the house? Uh, not right now. Okay. But Any smokers? Have... No. Okay. Alrighty. Dr. Sue, we're going to come in and do her exam and then get you out of here. I get to be nice to you today, okay? Hey. Because there's no shots. No uh, shots, uh, baby. No shots. We right. made it. She really didn't even <laughs> cry for real. Hey. It's okay, baby. Hold up. In the blanket. Uh-huh, daddy got you. Daddy. So we got some good news. Marae has gained an ounce. Oh. Hey, baby been feeding her. She been getting that colossal. Oh, my goodness. Colostrum. Okay, colostrum. You know what you're doing. Girl, don't be getting mad at me because I don't know what colostrum is. Are you down, little girl? So you can be nice and warm. All right. Tap back in when the doctor come in so we can go on deal. Hey, walk with a deal. Oh, drop the phone. She getting swaddled now. Y'all know well, what a swaddle is? Ain't. No, you swaddle good swaddle all the time. her enough. Well, it should be all right. Look at my baby little perfect head. Girl, huh? how many suckers you got in your mouth? One. Let me see. Oh. You know they usually come with a loop, but I, I don't eat they, suckers, so I wouldn't know. These, I think they cut the loop off. That's where she get it from. Look. Look at her trying to take it, it, it out. Or yours is cut it. <laughs> she tried to take it out of her mouth like she wasn't eating no sucker. <laughs> I see you. <laughs> All right, y'all. We'll tap back in here in a few. <laughs> then the boo boo hand outfit right here. <laughs> <laughs> My mama good. <laughs> <laughs> Your mouth gonna start watering. <laughs> I know you want it. Look at this right here, y'all. Three generations. Oh, oh, girl. Mama looking kind girl. of rough now. Let me, oh, well. What? Oh, me breastfeeding? Mm -hmm. Well, my shirt keep falling. So, just lightly put it over her head. Mm -hmm. For y'all trying to say said, she's... Why is she... I uh, said, that's like putting a blanket over her. Babe, you gonna want... What you gonna want her to do, like in sports? Ooh. Trillion, track, dance, everything I did. She probably do a lot more. Yeah. Everything that she want to do. Well, what if she don't want to do nothing and just spend all my money or our money? Probably not have her in basketball. I mean, sorry. I'm just really not a basketball fan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not. I'm not into basketball. Yeah. What about you? What you think? Um, maybe cheerleading, track and field. You no, know, you didn't even like me doing cheerleading because it would interfere it with track and it was hurt true. my back sometimes. True that, but you did it. But I loved it. 
I did love All Star Trilly. Because I like the fact that we could tumble and, and we can flip. Oh, I'm going to try it. Oh, you going to pass heal, out. After I y'all, I'm going to see if I still can do a back handspring. Well, no, I know I can do a back wait. handspring. I'm going to see if I can still do a tuck. You see if I can wait. pick this big old body up. Lose some Girl, weight. your body is not big. She weighed more than me. <laughs> Shoot, I don't, know talking about much, my baby. I don't know how much <laughs> Shoot, what time is it? I need to call and make an appointment for my doctor. He want to see me in two weeks. Girl, that's two weeks. Girl, I mean, I was about to call you, girl. girl. He's about to say, girl, I got to call early. I can't call at the last minute. Mm -hmm. right. nice how you doing, Doc? You heard great things about you. Um, who was your OB? Dr. Jose Garcia. Oh my gosh, all right. Oh, he's a hood. <laughs> no, no, you're toilet. No, please don't. Do you know, you're fine. Oh, you can stay here. Um, do you, um, did you have any problems during your pregnancy? No. Not at all. Pretty easy peasy. That's good. Never had to see the specialist for any reason. Excellent. And then, you oh, well, I do have to see a specialist I have a, a trans abdominal cerclage. Okay. That's the only reason, just to can do cervical checks and make sure my cervix is... Okay, who did you see for, is it somebody at perinatology you saw? Uh-huh. Who did you um, see to refer? Um, um, what is his name? Gomez. Okay. Dr. Gomez. All right. We got two of my favorite guys. <laughs> um, I've heard stool starting to change in color to becoming more like that yellow CD yep, liquidy today. stool. Okay. That mm -hmm. tells us she's getting and digesting Left the milk. Early this, early this morning it started, it was that in between mm -hmm. of having the macone and the sticky. Yep. And it was uh, trying to turn brownish. Yeah, brownish. Just now, we just had our first bowel. Okay. That was um, seedy and yellow. Okay, excellent. And do you think she's having at least, like, say, six wet diapers? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Every feeding, we change in a diaper afterwards. Um, alpha thalassemia. I'm a carrier alpha oh, you are? Okay. thalassemia. He's a carrier of sickle cell. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Mm -hmm. But we don't have the actual trait. Well, I got the trait. I mean, we don't have it. So you have, I mean, you carry the I, I trait, have sickle but you cell don't trait. have it. You don't have sickle cell. Yeah. And you have alpha cell trait. Yes. What does that mean? A blood something anemia. Like it's, it's similar to sickle cell. It's just um, as far as it's a problem, a disorder with the hemoglobin, but you have to have both genes to be affected. Meaning, if he was alpha cell carrier and you were an alpha cell carrier, yeah. that would be a dangerous. Now, yeah. your child probably will have. Possibly one of those traits, mm -hmm. but having the trait doesn't mean anything. Twenty-five percent chance. When of having you find blood that? Blood test, and I've learned I that it's from know. like um, it comes from like Asian. Um, you want to be Asian so bad. <laughs> Did you have that when it you comes from my Asian mind? side? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what percentage of Asian do you have? I have 8%. a percentage of uh, Asia. I don't remember what percentage. Seven percent. But I know that's probably definitely my, my dad's side. Mm. Mm -hmm. you, this is the first baby, right? Yes. Technically, and this is our first living child. We got three angel babies. Oh wow. Okay. Um, you had multiple miscarriages. Um, we had a actually we had a eight week miscarriage in 2014, and then due to incompetent service, I've lost. Um, a set of twins last year and I lost, we lost our first son. Oh my goodness, 2017, um, 2017 the year before, so. And now, was that, a, that was, was that a term? Did that 19 weeks, oh. we both losses, 19 weeks. Hence the surplage now. Yes, which held great. Wow. wow. Dr. Haney Tech held Dr. like Dr. Haney is the man. Yes. Yeah. Wow, that is, that, Wake up. She gonna wake Look up soon. Look at this little foot. <laughs> it's a little velvety. <laughs> I'm not in a way, am I? No, not at all. Her in the hospital, they, they checked her jaundice level. Did they talk to you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She was very, very low. Very, very low. Okay. Mm -hmm. I forgot the numbers. Was, oh, that's okay. It was under the average. 
They didn't need you to go back on Sunday to get another test, right? Oh, no. Okay. And she, was, she wasn't breached, was she, or was she? No, she wasn't. She was she not was breached. And it's normal. So little girls, it's normal for them to have a whitish colored discharge, and it can sometimes be real thick, and it can even be blood tinged sometimes in the first week, just from the withdrawal of the hormones. Her little uterus can just shed a little bit, and so just that can be normal. So not to worry. And the whitish stuff that you see, you don't need to be um, cleaning it out. It actually helps to protect the skin on the inside. But obviously, if she has a big poopy diaper and it's all in the little parts just there you, you don't have it. to go in exactly rooms. okay yeah and you always want to clean it gently from the front to the back and i always think it's a good idea once you're home to clean up this cord area with some just rubbing alcohol like isopropyl alcohol mm -hmm. once a day okay. it helps keep it clean it helps get and it to start dry, separating keep it dry, yeah dry. Mm -hmm. so i'm just going to clean them around it i just take these and i kind of squeeze a little bit in there kind of wipe them no, they don't really have nerve endings in here inside the um, it's like belly area. button, right? Yeah, it's, it, it's she doesn't like it because it's cold and it's wet. But it's a new sensation for her. Mm. 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 The first is working out okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. They shape like little hearts in it. Okay, sweet girl, you're okay. So I'm gonna turn the lights down because I want to see if I can get her open her eyes. Okay. okay. Of course, you don't want to do that. Here we go. Right, right. You don't like the light, do you? There we go. Mm. Tummy time. So during the day, before feeding, you're gonna put on her tummy, which you're already probably doing naturally when you're doing like a little skin to skin, mm -hmm. and she's kind of like popping her head. Mm -hmm. but, a, but a couple times a day, we're gonna put her like on a firm surface for her to start trying to lift up herself, like. And getting her next one. And if, you know, they're going to be kind of floppy at first because it's moving. Yeah, she's trying. Yeah. Uh -huh. Our work, guys. Right for here, baby girl. Oh. So real. <laughs> so I think she looks great. Ooh, oh, so I would try to wake her up during the day, like we talked about, at least every two two and a half hours from the beginning of one feeding to the beginning of the next. At yeah. night, we still probably need to wake her up until she can start gaining more weight, Like, but we can do maybe a little longer if she will, okay. like closer to three hours. Okay. Now babies have their newborns have their days and nights mixed up. They tend to want to be up all night and sleep all day. So if we're proactive and really try to keep her awake during the day by waking her up frequently and doing her tummy time and keeping the lights right. bright, yeah. she starts in and at night, keep the lights dim, we try to keep, you know, quiet everything down so that the days and nights can be a little different. Mm -hmm. um, this is about safe sleeping in the baby. So just like you set up her own separate sleep environment in your room, definitely no co-sleeping at this stage. And try your, try your best always when you're feeding her at night to put her back in the bassinet or the crib. Try and, if you fall asleep with her in your arms, it's really dangerous as well. Mm -hmm. And it's, it, you know, it can happen because you're exhausted, right? Mm -hmm. um, so try to make sure that we're doing that. And then when you put her down to sleep, obviously she's on her back. They tend to kind of like to put their head one way or the other. Mm -hmm. You just want to make sure she's not always putting her head in the same direction. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, they end up getting a little bit of more flattening or mm -hmm. positional flattening from always being in one direction. Mm -hmm. Okay? Um, on Thursday. Okay. And as long as she's gaining weight well at that visit, you know, if she's up a couple more ounces, then we may not need to see her back till she's a month old. Okay. Okay? And then you guys remember, try to bring in her newborn. Yes. Paperwork when you come in. Mm -hmm. Charge package. That's okay. No worries. <laughs> mm, you got any questions, baby? Uh. This Thursday. Line in her head. Oh yeah. 
So on the same side, yeah. this yeah. side too. Yep, those are important, and that soft spot is important. So the skull is formed of different bones, like they're almost like plates, and they're not fused together because, and those lines are where the plates Shoot. meet, yeah. right? So because the brain is growing. Mm. So that's what you're feeling, and sometimes mm. they call them suture lines. They can feel like a little bit more prominent. Mm. So totally. My baby got a little line. <laughs> <laughs> Her head can expand. Her brain. All right. Anything else? Any other questions? Nope. No questions. All right. See well, you Thursday. My concern yeah. was the little the vernix stuff that was still in her or the stuff in her vagina. I didn't know what to do with that. Yeah. Part. It's totally it's totally normal, and you can just leave it there. It helps it helps mm -hmm. protect the skin. Oh, yep. Okay. Cool beans. Awesome. We got neck. Uh, I got nephews, so I never had. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> and so sometimes this it's all new. And sometimes the hospital at discharge, they don't tell you that they can have blood tinge discharge. So a lot of parents, those are middle of the night calls we well, get to. They too. did let me know about the discharge coming from her vagina. Okay, Shit. they said that's normal. Okay. I was like, um. <laughs> they didn't tell me about that. <laughs> all right, he wasn't in there when she had um, the nurse had came oh, in. Yeah, I probably would have passed out. Right. <laughs> well, it's good to meet y'all. Nice and I will then see you on Thursday. And if there's any problems before, then just call us, okay? okay. Thank you. All right. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. All right. All right. We had a great visit. You had your first doctor appointment with your little red baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, you want to go on, check out? Yep. All right, y'all. Thanks for joining us on our little first Peds appointments. Her doctor is really, really nice. Very so nice. It went really well. We like the facility here. Yeah, it's nice. It's clean. Yeah. Doctor was really nice. Great doctor. And her appointment went good, and she's looking all good and gained an ounce. So. Got a lot of great information. Hopefully, back Thursday. some of you new parents can use some of this information if you don't feel comfortable enough with your doctor. Yeah, you know, somebody as, you know, not, I mean, you know, somebody as old as Mama Liz, she's only 35, but, uh, you know, even she didn't know about it. So, you know, don't be too proud to ask for information that you don't know, especially when it's pertaining to your kids or your grandkids. You know, it's not about you and, you know, it's about the kids and making sure that they are, they are okay. So. I know I'm not afraid to ask any questions, especially if I don't know. I'm smart enough to know what I don't know. But that's all for today. Ray Ray, you want to say bye bye to good one season? She got the hiccups. Holla if you hear me. Oh. All right, baby. You smell her fart? It's lingering like a mole. Ooh. Ooh. Jesus. Oh, girl, you get that from your mama. Ooh All right, y'all. Like, comment, subscribe down below. We'll see y'all next time. Say peace, baby. Dang. Peace. Did I do this wrong? Peace. Give me the hand, baby. Give me the hand. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs>